Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to disassemble the Canon 24-105mm f4 lens for calibration. Recently I had this lens which needed to be calibrated. So I disassembled the lens, then I calibrated it using a blog post which link is in the description below. If you are interested in the full disassembly and assembly of the lens, you can find the links here or down in the description below. First, let me talk about the tools that I will use to disassemble the lens. I will use a PH30 screwdriver, a PH20 screwdriver, a metal tweezers, a plastic tweezers and a small hex key. If you are interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it, share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So, let's get started. This is the lens which will be calibrated. Remove the two smaller screws from the electronic connector. Remove the four screws from the bayonet. Lift off the bayonet a little bit and push up the inner plastic cover. Be careful not to damage the flat cable between the electronic connector and the circuit board. Remove the rear cover. Disconnect the flex cables. Remove the screw from the PCB, then remove the PCB. Remove the zoom rubber ring. Remove the zoom brush cover, then remove the screw and the zoom brush.
remove the metal pin from the zoom ring. Remove the zooming ring. Remove the screws from the rear plastic cover ring of the lens. Remove the rear plastic cover ring. Remove the screws from the USM motor and then remove the USM motor unit. Those are the small screws which can be used to calibrate the lens. In order to twist them, you will need small hex keys. In the next steps, I have to assemble the lens without the USM motor, so I put back the rear cover of the lens. Put back the screws to the rear of the lens.
put back the rear cover of the lens. Put back the metal bayonet. This is where the small holes of the electronic connector should be. Put back the four bigger screws into the bayonet mount. We are done. Now we have access to the eccentric screws, which can be used to calibrate the lens. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it, share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. Links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. See you next time in another video.